Hey guys, this is Vimal here and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be quite interesting and also knowledgeable. So make sure to watch it till the end. And also there's a special surprise for you people in this video. So make sure not to skip any part of the video. I'll be getting there in a moment. So the product I'll be showing you in this video is a brand new NAS system from Synology. This is their high performance NAS guys called the DS420 Plus which they've launched recently. And in this video, I'll be giving like my complete review and experience about this product. See guys, if you don't know, NAS is called as network attached storage. It's like a storage drive that is connected to the internet guys. That means, you know, it's like a public cloud storage, your own personal cloud storage that you can access from anywhere in the world using any sort of device. Like you can use your computer, a laptop or even your smartphone to access this drive and you know, check out the contents on it. And the best part is it's like completely private guys. Apart from you and other people that you give permission to, nobody else can see what's on this NAS. So that is what a NAS is. Again, I don't want to drag this video by, you know, going through all the basics and telling you everything about a NAS. I've like made plenty of NAS videos in the past on my channel. I'll just leave links to them in the in the card above. You can check it out there. You'll get complete information on what a NAS is, what you can do with that and all that stuff. So make sure to watch that video. So that was about NAS guys. And also NAS is not just like a cloud storage device guys. It's much more smart than that. It's got its like its own operating system and you know it's got like built-in applications, services so you can do a lot using this NAS and I'll be giving a few examples also in this video very useful examples that you can do with the NAS. Uh, so coming to the product guys, the product name, the model is called as DS420 Plus. This is a four bay drive system and the best part is it also has like SSD catch acceleration guys. So what happens is you, it's got two M.2 slots on it. So you can insert two, two M.2 NVMe SSD drives to speed up the performance by up to 20% using Synology's SSD cache acceleration. That is something very unique. And this thing is powered by uh, Intel's newest Celeron two core CPU guys. 64-bit CPU with boost core clock frequencies of up to 2.9 gigahertz and comes with 2 GB of DDR4 RAM. For a NAS, 2 GB is actually quite high guys. Usually on the basic entry-level NAS, you get only around like 512 MB of RAM. So compared to that, this is like a high performance NAS system. If you talk about the unboxing, I'll just quickly unbox it and show you. There's nothing much in the box actually. Uh, so on opening the package, you only get like the Synology's new DS420 plus NAS system. There's a power adapter and a main cord for the adapter. Apart from that, you only have like two LAN cables so that you can easily connect the NAS system to your router at your home. So that's it. Those are all the package contents of the NAS system. So what I'll do is I'll quickly go through the highlights and specs of this NAS and then we'll power it on and I'll show you all the DSM operating system features, applications and what else you can do with this NAS system. All right, so before going over there, let me just quickly tell you the surprise part that I've planned for you people. See, it's festival time, right? Diwali is coming up and I thought, chalo, let's arrange a special giveaway for you people on my channel. And you know, that's why I've collaborated with Synology and you know, arranged a special NAS system giveaway where I'll be giving away Synology's new DS220 plus NAS system, guys. It's a two drive bay NAS system worth around 30,000 rupees. And you know, it's a pretty awesome thing that you definitely like to have in your computer setup. So this was a surprise I wanted to tell you all. See, to participate and win this giveaway, it's very simple, guys. You just have to follow some small conditions and terms. Well, I'll be telling you that at a later part in the video, so stay tuned for that. Now, getting back to the features and highlights, I've told you, right, this is a four drive bay NAS system that is powered by Intel Celeron CPU, has two gigs of DDR4 RAM and offers up to 225 MB per second read and write performance. And along with that, I've told you, right, it's got four drive bay systems. So in those drives, you can install both hard disks and SSDs. Hard disk can be installed up to like 3.5 inch ones and 2.5 inch models also. And for the SSDs, you can install 2.5 inch models. And along with that, you also have two M.2 NVMe slots for using Synology's SSD cache acceleration technology. So these are all the storage drives and slots available on the NAS. And coming to the drives, guys, the drives I'll be using for my NAS system is from Seagate. The model is Iron Wolf, guys. These Iron Wolf drives are made exclusively for NAS systems. And let me tell you, they offer like excellent performance, guys. They've got like high durability, 
of a very good read and write speeds and are available in large storage capacities up to 14 TB. And I've got like four drive base on the NAS, right? So I'll be loading up all the four drive base with all these uh, Ironwolf NAS, each of two TB. So we've got a total of like eight TB storage available on my NAS system. And installing the drives in the NAS is also like super simple, guys. Just pull up the lever of the drive systems on the front and each tray will individually come out just like this. Now place your hard disk or SSD as per your convenience and requirement in over there. And you know, put back those locks from the side and just simply Simply slide in the tray back into its original position and push it until you hear a click sound. And that's it, you've successfully installed your drive. Very easy guys, plug and play type. And you can even lock these drives so that nobody else can remove the drives using the provided key in the box. I'll quickly set it up and I'll show you how the NAS interface looks like and all the different applications and software features this NAS offers. So as mentioned before guys, Synology's NAS system comes with its own operating system known as DSM. DSM stands for Disk Station Manager and let me tell you, it's a smart operating system and offers like a lot of applications and features. First thing, if you talk about the UI, this is how the UI and the home screen on it looks like. It's got a very clean, simple and user-friendly UI and is like very easy to use. So on the home screen itself, you can completely monitor your NAS system on the lower right corner and going to the top side, you've got all the system settings like shutdown, reboot and all that stuff. So those are the general settings. Now coming to the left side, you can see that we've got some shortcuts for all the applications installed on the NAS system. So guys, this thing has its own app store known as Packet Center from where you can download like numerous number of applications depending on your requirement. It's got a big list over there. Just check out the list. You've got everything you need over here suppose you want to back up stuff there's an app for that there's a dedicated app for viewing photos there's a dedicated app for streaming stuff and there's also a browser and a lot more stuff guys like file manager storage analyzer and the list just goes on and also one more thing I have to mention guys, this is a high performance NAS, right? So the UI, the fonts time, how quickly it was downloading and installing apps on the system. Everything was like pretty smooth and I faced no sort of lags or issues on the DS420+. Plus. Okay, so let me tell you my favorite apps and you know features available on the NAS. See, there's a big list, right? I can't cover all of them. So I'll be mentioning like some of my favorites and let me start with the backup solution. First thing I'd like to mention is called as a hyper backup guys. See hyper backup is super useful. It's like a centralized backup solution that lets you backup stuff from a variety of devices like either from your computer or even from your smartphone or even from online public cloud storages like from Google Drive, Dropbox and stuff like that. You can backup all these and store in the NAS system. And the great thing is it does all this backup automatically guys. So you know you're always like up to date and you can have no fear of your files you know being lost or getting deleted you'll have a backup of everything in the NAS system so that is one nice thing that I wanted to tell you all and the second thing I'd like to tell you all is about the streaming feature guys see suppose there's some video or photo present on the NAS system and you want to watch it on your TV or maybe computer or somewhere else you don't actually need to copy the stuff into like a pen drive or a hard disk from the NAS you can directly stream content from the NAS system itself to your TV or computer guys but keep in mind that for that your TV should be smart enough and should support casting feature and all that. So like this, using this uh, streaming service, you can directly stream movies or videos, anything directly onto your TV. And the third one I'd like to mention is a downloads manager, guys. So there's a dedicated download station app on the NAS. Suppose you want to download some big file from the internet and you don't want to waste space on your smartphone or laptop. What you can do is you can simply copy that URL link and paste it in this download station of the NAS. And what will happen is it will directly download that file onto the NAS system. This is also a very useful application. And then you've got more applications like there's also a surveillance uh, station where you can manage all your security camera stuff, guys. Suppose you have like four to five security cameras in your office and you want to monitor all of them at the same time and also record footage from them and store in a big backup drive. Then you can simply install this surveillance app on your NAS system and connect it to those cameras and that's it guys from here itself you can like directly switch between the cameras and record footage from them and you know completely control all of them using one single app. Very useful for offices also. And like this guys the list just goes on there are like numerous number of applications and software features uh, available on Synology NAS. 
uh, there's also one more really nice uh, application known as Synology Drive. This is like your own private cloud storage, guys. Uh, so you don't have to depend on some public cloud storage and play monthly subscription on that. It's like you can create your own private cloud storage using this and access it from anywhere in the world. All right, guys. So this is what I wanted to share with you all in this video. So before we conclude the video, let me talk about the giveaway. I know you people have been waiting for this part like eagerly. So let me tell you, as mentioned before, I'll be giving away one Synology NAS system. The model is DS220 Plus. It's a great mid-range two drive bay NAS system, guys, and offers like really cool applications and features, which I've mentioned in the video. So it costs around like 30,000 rupees in India, and you definitely like to win and have this in your setup. So to participate in this giveaway, see rules and conditions are like very simple. You just just have to answer some basic questions in a survey conducted by Synology team guys. The link is in the description box only. So once you answer that, you'll automatically be registered for the event and you know, uh, enter in the giveaway. So Synology is only handling everything guys. They will only be randomly picking up the winner, uh, like whoever has participated and registered in the event and they'll be announcing the giveaway winner in like 10 days on their handle. I'll also be sharing the news so uh, you can stay tuned to my social media also where I'll be sharing who the winner is and all that stuff. So guys go there right now, participate and register for the event and hope the best person win. Well, that is pretty much it guys. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more new awesome videos. And I'll see you all in my next one.